Hello there, welcome to another episode of The Cash Show. It is so good to see you. You look fantastic. Hopefully you feel as good as you look. And are you feeling lucky? Because this is the place to be. The Cash Show is on right now with a chance to win cold hard cash. This is trivia, it's 12 questions and all, and that money goes right to your PayPal account. No muss, no fuss, very easy, very fun. Here's how the game works. 12 questions in all. We have non-prize questions and prize questions. You get through all the non-prize questions to the prize question rounds. That's where you start seeing that cold hard cash coming right into your PayPal account. And that's where it gets really, really frantic and really crazy. And that's what it's all about, right? That's what it's all about. Now, I'm going to give you some tips. Are you ready? Now, come a little bit closer just because I don't want you to miss this. You can get extra lives by inviting your family and friends to play the game. The more people you invite in, the more lives each of you will get. It's just that easy. And you know, one more tip, I think you need one more. Connect your Facebook account to eliminate wrong answers. That's what it's all about right here on The Cash Show. So don't forget to turn on your push notifications. Please spread the word about turning on the push notifications because you know what? Let's face it. If you don't know we're here, you can't play the game. And if you can't play the game, you can't win the cold hard cash for answering trivia questions. Are you ready? I know I am. Let's get started. How many colors are in a traditional rainbow? Five, seven, ten. The best way to remember the colors of the rainbow goes like this. Roy G. Biv. Red, orange, yellow, Roy. G, green, blue, indigo, violet, Biv. There you go. Who wrote Romeo and Juliet? Charles Dickens, Mark Twain, William Shakespeare. Between 1591 and 1595, English writer and poet William Shakespeare created the tragic romance of Romeo and Juliet, the lovers who are willing to die in order to prove their love to their feuding families. Which of the following is the smallest fraction? One half, one fourth, one eighth. You see, this is always what confused me when it came to math. Even though the bottom number is the largest, one eighth is the smallest unit compared to one third or one fourth. Just so confusing. Who has been a judge on the U.S. versions of American Idol and The X Factor? Kelly Rowland, Simon Cowell, Randy Jackson. Man, these reality talent competitions have just taken over over the last few years, but only Simon Cowell and Paula Abdul have been a judge on both shows. Cowell also judged the British version of American Idol called Pop Idol and the British X Factor. In which Olympic sport are participants forbidden from sporting a beard? Fencing, boxing, basketball. I thought it was just a fashion thing, but I guess I was wrong big time. Some of the reasons that bearded boxers are forbidden is because it can cushion blows, conceal parts of the face, open cuts, and could be slippery for the opponent's gloves.
What gas would you inhale to lower the pitch of your voice? Helium, methane, sulfur hexafluoride. Well, if you weren't born with a rich, deep, bassy voice like mine, you can turn to sulfur hexafluoride. It is six times heavier than air, making it have the opposite effect of helium when consumed. I can't wait. What English king signed the Magna Carta in 1215? King John, King Henry IV, King Edward I. The charter was written to make peace between the unpopular King John and a group of rebel barons, and it gave the barons a whole bunch of protections so they wouldn't usurp the king. Too bad John died one year later and the barons started a war. What was the only state that George W. Bush did not visit during his presidency? Alaska, Rhode Island, Vermont. The tiny, quaint state of Vermont. And despite having visited all 49 states, Bush avoided the socialist safe haven, which in 2008 indicted him and Dick Cheney for crimes against our Constitution. In Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, which of the five children is shrunk down? Baruch Assault, Mike TV, Augustus Gloop. Although Mike TV gets shrunk down by Willy Wonka's teleporting TV, Mr. Wonka assures his parents that he can be easily stretched back out. Alas, they stretch him out so that he ends up around 10 feet tall. Which of these animals is not native to Australia? Quoll, emu, alligator. Although Australia is home to two different species of crocodile, and has an area called Alligator Rivers, there are no alligators in the country. Alligators are native to only the United States and China. Who is the current president of Cuba? Raul Castro, Fidel Castro, Miguel Diaz Canal. Diaz Canal was selected after a secret vote in Cuba in 2018, though he ran unopposed. He was not even born when Fidel Castro led his revolution in 1959, and it will be the first time since then that a Castro will not lead the country. Which vegetable was traditionally carved at Halloween prior to being replaced by the pumpkin? Turnip, beetroot, sweet potato. Halloween is a Celtic holiday, and pumpkins are not native to Ireland. They originally used to carve jack-o'-lanterns out of turnips to help ward off evil spirits. You can also ward off kids at dinner time with turnips. Wow, what an incredible round of the cash show. We have winners, that's right. Congratulations to our winners who got all 12 questions right. Check out the prize payment distribution and see how many people got each question right. Not bad, guys. And now here are your winners. Congratulations to you guys. Is your name up there? Is your friend's name up there? Well, even if your name is not up there, you will have plenty of other chances of playing the cash show. Now, don't forget to tell your family and friends invite them in because you'll each get extra lives and also connect your Facebook account to eliminate wrong answers. Just some tips for you. That's how it works. Don't forget, please turn on your push notifications and spread the word to your family, friends, coworkers. I know your mom told you not to talk to strangers, but invite the strangers on over too. Tell them to turn on their push notifications as well because if you don't know we're playing, 
you can't play the game. And if you can't play the game, you can't win real cash. We'll see you next time on The Cash Show.